it's time to transition from my traditional mechanical keyboard like the new feature matey to an ego split keyboard this is the digma race 2 a 60 percent mechanical ego keyboard it is a hot swappable wireless and fully programmable keyboard this is actually the second version of the race series with upgrade to the thumb cluster keys tenting kit and palm rest what really sold me on this keyboard is the split design where i can position the halves exactly where i need them for me this is a game changer for my shoulder pain and overall typing posture the digma race offers both bluetooth and wired options which is great i currently use the wired mode I'm a big fan of Bluetooth connectivity but I've also noticed that the battery life takes a hit when I have the LED lights on. I've also experienced a few connectivity hiccups here and there, so I've decided to embrace the wired life until the Bluetooth functionality is a bit more stable. A pointing device, it just made more sense to go with the trackpad and have the trackpad right in the middle of the split keyboard. By placing my trackpad right in the center of my split keyboard, I found out that my hand movement is minimized and I'm able to maintain a more comfortable and larger position. While the Digma Race comes with its own set of keycaps, I found out that they didn't quite provide the feel I was looking for, so I decided to upgrade to this desk MS profile keycaps. It's amazing how something as simple as changing your keycaps can have such a big impact on your typing comfort. If you're someone who spends a lot of time typing, I highly recommend exploring different keycap options and profiles to find the one that works best for you. The Digma Race 2 is a hot swappable keyboard, so of course I'm going to install new switches. These are the Gatorin Beer switches, it comes pre looped which is really good. With an actuation force of 50 grams, they are not too heavy and not too light. It may not be the best choice for heavy tactile levels but I actually love the sound and feel of this switch. This keyboard comes with built in tenting legs that allow you to adjust the angle of the keyboard to your liking. The tenting feature is incredibly easy to use, you just flip out the legs of the bottom of the keyboard. But first, you need to flip out the little extra feet because without the extra feet, the keyboard feels a little bit wobbly. You can adjust the angle between 5 degrees to 60 degrees. The tenting legs feel and look very durable. I think the legs are made of aluminium and EBS plastic. The fact that this feature is built right into the keyboard is a huge plus for me. It's all right there, ready to go whenever you need it. The Digma Race comes with these removable palm pads that are attached magnetically to the board. I have used the keyboard with and without the palm pads and the difference in comfort is just night and day. The palm pads are really sturdy and they hardly move under pressure. 